Hi guys, myself is Hari KT introducing you the Aura project for PHP. This is the first introductory tutorial on how you can install the Aura framework. First, I will tell you about the brief, a brief introduction about the Aura project. The Aura project uh, provides independent library packages for PHP 5.4. This is the second major version of Solar PHP. The name change is due to the reduce the confusion of the Apache Solar. This is the brainchild of Paul M. Johns, the father of benchmarking frameworks. The primary goal is high quality, well tested independent library packages that can be used in any world, in any code base. Currently we have autoload the APSR zero auto loader we follow the PSR 0 1 2 also we have a dependency injection container we have filters we have HTTP request and response a router a session management signals and sol signal slots like events and observer patterns something like that SQL for connection between querying and stuff, it's on the top of the PDO itself. You have view; it's a two-step view, and the web and the about the controllers. So <coughs> the framework is made with the help of a system repository, which incorporate all the packages into a coherent framework. So we will go to the page the Aura PHP github.com Aura PHP slash system you want to first download the system you will be going to downloads page the downloads page is like here if you are downloading the packages download packages it will contain all the packages like Aura.cli everything but when you are downloading from here you will be getting only the system repository zip folder which doesn't contain the packages there are other packages so I have downloaded the Aurora PHP system for system repository you want to unzip here once you are downloaded now I'm going to rename it Aurora system the PHP system okay I'm moving to my favorite folder Please, I'm going to a terminal. Okay, our uh, PHP system. Now you can see the directory structure. You can see there is no packages inside the package folder. All the packages like Aura.cli, any packages which is complied to Aura, is inside the package folder. So <coughs> to install the other other packages like uh, you can install via Composer or you can install via Git itself. If you have Git install, you can run php update.php. It will install the whole packages to the package folder. Or if you don't have, if you have um, composer you if you want to uh, use composer we have a composer.json here which contains the all all packages which you want to download here and you can edit the composer.json to add more packages like paginator or menu or anything like any other packages from the packages.org and run the PHP composer.far which you can download via get composer dot walk I guess yeah get composer will be downloading a composer dot pack the composer file it's it's too it's easy you can get it from here so it's like w get get composer uh, here you will be seeing these particular stuffs wget http get composer.org composer.fa 
once you have downloaded that particular one I have already the in my so I'm not going to download it once you have downloaded it you can run the composer.far uh, and install once you have done this all the packages will be going to download in the package folder so I'll not be downloading the whole packages I will just show you a demonstration on how it's going to download after a few minutes I will cancel this particular stuff and I will move to the other one which I already have downloaded uh, I okay let's move to the other one because uh, my internet connection is too slow that's why I will not be able to show you that stuff okay I will move to the other area where I have already downloaded the whole packages okay it was a free I will show you a last package the packages which I already have downloaded here this is the packages our dot auto load CLI dependency injection filters framework HTTP Marshall like that stuff everything is here once you are downloaded it you can go to PHP web that's PHP minus s localhost Let's move on. That's it. Hello world is done. Now in another tutorial I'll be showing you how the package structure is, how you can create your own packages, our own our packages like that. And it's as I told you it's a standalone. I will show you one more example how you can install as a component only once you so you just want to go and type this much in your composer.json minimum stability dev because the minimum stability dev is because composer will only install if it's if there if it's stable only else it will if it's in beta release candidate or anything it will it needs the minimum stability dev that's the requirement that's a composer requirement so as ARA is on beta 3 we need minimum stability dev and what are the things that you want to go to uh, you want to download is that for example I am going to download our session package or we can change it to filter I am interested in filters let's change it our session ok no add it our session filter Filter, they must show. Okay, install. Let's install. PSP dot dot slash com as a composer dot file. Okay, update because I already have installed the session. That's why. Let's see whether it's downloads stuff. It's take some time, some time. Okay, let's uh, see what are the steps I have in the vendor. Here you can see the vendor has Aura, which contains, yeah, it's downloading. Yeah, it downloads. Right? No. Okay, this was, yeah, here. So I run php composer.far update because I already was having the session. So I just run update. That's why I'm run update here. So the Aura filter was downloaded to the vendor slash Aura filter folder. You can see filter. Thanks for watching the introductory tutorial on installing Aura framework. This is me, Harigedi, signing off. Please give me the feedback because this is the first introduction to our project and this is my first screencast I have ever done. Thanks.
right